this is Virgo the Oracle, and I'm here to do a reading for the sign of Virgo. Hey, Virgo, how are you? Let's tap into this energy like we always do. Come through spirit for Virgo. What messages do you have for Virgo? Hey, everybody, how you doing? How was your week? I hope you guys had a wonderful week. And I hope you have an even better weekend. Let's look into this energy for Virgo. Mm -hmm. Please remember to... Uh, if this resonates, give me a thumbs up, okay? If you haven't subscribed, I would love to have you join us. This is what we do every week, a couple times a week. We tap into this energy for Virgo. Spirit come through. What messages do you have for Virgo? Sun, moon, and rising. Virgo energy. Mm -hmm. Spirit, what messages do you have for Virgo? What's the energy surrounding Virgo? What messages do you have for Virgo? What do you want to tell them? What do you want them to know? Spirit come through. Come through, spirit for Virgo. Sun, moon, and rising. Sun, moon, and rising. Okay. Virgo, your first position that you have is the star. Okay. Mm -hmm. I got the ace of wands. Okay. You got justice. You got the four of wands. Mm-hmm. That's a death card. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. You got the six of swords. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You have the... What is this? The king of swords. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. You got the seven of swords. Ay, ay, ay. Lovers in reverse. The moon. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. King of Cups. Temperance. Okay. Alright. Alright. Not bad. Let's see what we got here. Mm-hmm. Spirit come through. Let's see what we got here. Mm-hmm. Is that on your eye shot? Where's my wand? Give me my wand. Okay. Alright, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six major kind as well. Wow, okay. That's the current energy right now that's surrounding you guys at the bottom of the deck. Mm, some of you are in your fields right now. We got the Queen of Cups. Some of you guys are very emotional. When it comes to this to romance or this thing called love, okay, whoever you're connected to, whoever you're thinking about and during this read, you're very emotional over this person right now, okay? You got strong feelings for this person, okay? Mm-hmm, mm hmm This person could be procrastinating. They taking too goddamn long. Uh-huh. You might be getting fed up. You love this person, but this person is bullshitting. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, this person won't shit or get off the pot. It's like they keep you hanging on. Okay, this person moves slow, they procrastinate, slow as a snail. But here's the thing this is the night we can trust. This person doesn't have good intentions towards you. Okay, they just bullshit a lot, very slow. They tell you one thing and do another. You wait, 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 wait. You might be getting tired of waiting. Oh, you're dead. Okay, you're tired of waiting. You done already left or you're about to leave. Love be damned. You see all those cups she leaves them behind? Yeah, you might be tired of the fuckery, the mind fuckery that this person is trying to put you through. Mm, look at that. No, you ain't going nowhere. We got the Ace of Cups. The feelings is mutual. You guys really do love each other. Okay, this person does feel the same way about you. They might not tell you. Hell, you might not tell them. But this is the Ace of Cups. This is new beginnings in love. You guys both want the same thing. This is not over by a long shot. Nope. Mm -mm. Nine of Cups. You're going to get the outcome that you want. Wish fulfillment. Okay. Ooh, victory. Lord, you're getting attention. You're getting a lot of attention right now, Virgo. Uh-huh. Yeah, people see who you are now. Or this person sees who you are. They know who you are. They getting the rec you're getting the recognition that you deserve. Okay? This is the victory card. You're going to get the outcome that you want. You're winning. All right? Yeah, people are cheering you on. Add a girl, add a boy. A lot of people calling your name. Everybody needs you all of a sudden. Watch them comebacks. Watch those comebacks, okay? You might got some people coming back from the past. 
All right, you know, treat it with a long handed spoon. You know, some people can take your energy very well, some people can't. Okay, they mean well, they love you to death, but you might be too much for them. Okay, some of you guys are too attractive, you're too positive, you're too blessed, you're too lucky, you're too this, you're too that, and some people can't take it. So pick and choose. Okay, first position, we got the star. Yeah, you're getting a lot of attention. Okay, some of you are very popular energies. Okay, mm -hmm. some of you get a lot of people wanting your attention, calling your name. What are you doing? I want to do it with with you mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but you got one in particular who wants your attention okay this is somebody who's very passionate over you they want a new beginning with you they want a fresh start now mind you this could be new love coming in but it looks like to me this is somebody that you already know okay doing looking at the, the bottom of this card okay because you're in love this is somebody that you already know you already love okay Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This person could have mistreated you. They, they, you could have been in a relationship with this person. They didn't do right by you. Okay. Yeah, they didn't do right by you in the relationship that you were in or that you wanted with them. Okay. It looks like that you were in with them. Okay. We got the justice card. You know that come out when it's been some sort of injustice, some sort of mistreatment, some, some, some sort of fuck over energy. Okay. You have endured from this person. Uh huh. Possibly a Libra. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, some of you might be filing for a divorce, Virgo. You might need to file for divorce or something like that. Or your person needs to file for divorce to have a relationship with you. Somebody didn't do right by you in a relationship, okay? But they're ready to change, okay? They want to change for that. They, they got a lot of passion for you, okay? They might be calling you on you a lot, calling your phone, texting you, coming past your house. You're very popular to this person now, okay? Even though you walked away from them, even though you left them, okay? You left because you weren't happy. You it wasn't getting what you wanted in this relationship. This person could have betrayed you, backstabbed you, all kinds of fuck shit, but this justice card can go down. That's that fuck over energy, that disrespect, you know, just just not doing right by you, okay? Lying to you, cheating on you, but the truth is being revealed. This person might be getting a great deal of karma for how they treated you, but it looks like some change is taking place here. We have the death card, okay? This is endings and this is beginnings, okay? So this behavior could have ended due to you walking away. Sometimes the people's eyes don't wake up or you know they don't see things for what it is until it's no longer there okay you could have moved on uh-huh you left because you wasn't happy you went somewhere and you got happy you left because you just was not happy in this situation at all well now you are now you got this person's attention okay now this person wants to talk to you with this king of swords this person wants to come bring you some truth some honesty like i said they might be catching a great deal of karma due to how they treated you how they behaved when they were with you they took advantage of your kindness took advantage that you will always be there that you would keep tolerating their smug ass or something like like that okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah now this person wants to come talk to you and you're like why what you got to say to me okay because we got the seven of cups here so you like what could you possibly have to say to me you know you feel this person is a liar you feel this person is has betrayed you or you or or just fake Okay, because you know the seven of swords is like fake ass people, fake ass energy, like a wolf's in sheep's clothing. You don't trust this person. Okay, you feel this person just wasn't honest, and all you got from this person was uh, little to no effort at all. This person could have very much betrayed you, lied to you, okay? Yeah, they could have been lying, telling everybody that they really didn't want you, they really wasn't fucking with you, they really didn't love you, they really didn't see uh, what you guys had, or, or they really wasn't into you like that. They could have really been lying because we got this lovers in reverse. They could have been lying about being with you. They could have been lying about loving you, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, whatever they were doing, you no longer love their ass, okay? Or you didn't feel the same. This is what made you walk walk away, okay? But I believe this person was lying about how they feel about you because we got the moon card next to that, okay? This is secrets, okay? This is secrets. And how they really feel about you is this king of cups right here. This person might have been telling somebody that they're not really seeing you and they're not really into you. They might have been saying, oh, they that you chasing them or you, you really want them, okay? you It's all in your head. You never said you was in a relationship with them this person could have been talking a whole lot of fuck shit until you walked away now you got this person's attention now ain't there nothing mm, 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 mm. this person was talking shit yeah we got secrets this person was keeping secrets they tried to keep you a secret or they feelings for you a secret but the feel, the secret they was really keeping is how they truly feel about you. This person was lying. This was lying. They were lying about how they felt about you. Possibly to their friends, to their family members, 
to another partner they was messing around with at the time or something like that. But with their secret, the secret that they really keep is how they truly feel about you. Mm -hmm. They want back in. They want reconciliation with you. This person might have been a real thorn in your side, a real pain in your ass. If this person ain't teach you nothing else, they taught you patience. Okay? If this person ain't teach you nothing else, they taught you patience. You might have been spiritually attacked, too, by this person or by people surrounding this person. Okay? You might have felt, you might feel that your enemies was trying to destroy you surrounding this person. Okay? Enemies like their ex, their ex-girlfriends, their sisters, their brothers, their cousins, whoever they hang around with, who did not want you two together because that's all it is. They didn't want this person with you. Okay? You might have felt attacked by that. You might have been experiencing some attack. Okay, and that's another reason why you said, uh-uh, I'm done, I'm out. Okay, well, now you have this person's attention. Now, then this person wants to come back. They want to try to reclaim this relationship with you. This person has a lot of passion for you. This might have been a highly sexual, high, highly sexual connection that you had with this person. This person misses you. They miss you sexually, uh, physically. They miss that, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And remember, they're getting their ass kicked. Okay, they're getting a lot of karma. Nothing is going right in this person's life, okay? They feel or or they believe if they come and do right by you, that things will balance out. Things will be better, okay? And, they, and they're pretty much right, okay? They owe you some sort of an apology, okay? This person owes you something, an apology, an explanation. This person has to come and rectify this, okay? And this is what they're planning on doing with this temperance and this justice card. Here they have to. Okay, they have to if they want any kind of peace of mind because they're not happy. Okay, this person was lying and betraying and showing their ass, and now they want to come talk to you. Like about what? What you want to come talk to me about? Continue lying and keep keep continue with your fake ass energy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because this person was telling somebody they really wasn't into you, they really didn't love you. When that's the farthest from the truth, this person was madly in love with you. Okay, let's pull some clarifiers and see what else we can get. Yeah, this person still loves you. Okay, and you guys know it. You you got you got six cents. You can feel it. Okay, let's see what else we got. Spirit come through. Should we do anything else? I don't know. I haven't did it. Let's try these. I haven't done this so long. Okay. Spirit come through. I got so many decks. I don't know which ones to reach for sometime. Spirit come through. Spirit come through. Can we have some more messages, please, for Virgo? Virgo got somebody who wants to reclaim this relationship, Spirit. Somebody wants back in with you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, this person is hooked on you, Virgo. This person is hooked on you, okay? This person don't want to say goodbye. I don't think they can, okay? Whoever you guys are dealing with. Okay, you might have saw them recently. Okay. Yeah, they might have been over recently. Or they called you recently. Or you heard something recently. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Love you more than my life. Lord Lee, Lord Lee. Who did y'all got? <laughs> Some of y'all got somebody lost and turned the fuck out. Lord have mercy. Oh, Olivia. I done start singing the whispers. Honey, yes, they lost and turned out. Shout out to the whispers. Somebody is Olivia. Lost and turned out. Okay, spirit come through. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can you give me one more chance? Somebody needs needs you, okay? Somebody recognize who you are or what you were to them. They recognize how happy you made them. You might have brought light to their life, okay? You might have brought uh, energy that they have never felt before. Uh-huh. And when you walked away, you took it, okay? Light went, they life went very dark after you walked away okay mm, shamanic energy no wonder okay some of you are shamans okay medicine man medicine woman you just make people feel good period you're healers okay come from a long line of healers okay yeah you guys are healers a lot of people like to hang around you when you know you see you need to send them that fuck home okay people want to hang around you they want to Feed off your energy like little energy vampires. Be mindful of that, okay? And some of you are talking too much. Stop telling your business, okay? Don't tell your business. Walk in silence, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm not chasing you. I'm not begging you. I'm not stressing over you. Do I want you? Of course. But I won't wait on you, okay? This is the energy that you're in right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Some of you have stopped talking. 
Some of you used to do too much goddamn talking to this person. You was trying to warn them. You was trying to tell them. You was trying to, you know, let them know what's going on. Some of you have went quiet. You said no more talking because you're not hearing me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You said no more talking because you're not hearing me. I can show you better than I can tell you. Some of you said no more talking. That's it. Yep, the power is in your hand, and you know it, okay? Very powerful energy, okay? Took some of you a long time to get to this uh, energy that you're in now, or this point in your life now, okay? You might have took a lot from this person before you got this strength, because the power is definitely in your hand now. Trust your intuition, okay? You're doing what's best for you. You're walking on, you're, you're, you're trusting yourself, okay? And by trusting yourself and relying on your, on your intuition, you, a lot of doors are opening for you. A lot of blessings are on. You're realizing that the universe is on your side, okay? We got on your side. I'm on your side. Okay, you're realizing that the universe is on your side, okay? You might have been tried to tell this person that you were on their side, okay? This person might have thought you was out to get them. You was out to use them or manipulate them. You want them only for their money or only for their they big dick energy or only for their beauty. You just wanted arm candy. You just wanted sex. This person could have thought, no matter who you were here for, that you was just using them for whatever they can give you, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But now they're starting to see. Somebody's a chef who likes to cook. Somebody loves to cook. Somebody gets paid big money to cook. Somebody might be in school to become a chef or something like that. Some of you are dealing with Taurus, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Spirit come through. Can I have some more? How did you get here? Nobody is supposed to be here, Okay. Some of you feel, how did this person get in your heart? How did this person get in your mind like this? How did this person get this close to you? Some of you have trust issues. You never let nobody get this close to you or something like that. This might be how this person feels. How did you get here? Nobody's supposed to be here. This might You might be dating somebody who don't let people get close to them. Hell, you might be somebody that don't let nobody get close to you. Okay. And come through, spirit. This person loves you more than you know. They just don't know what to do with it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they just don't know. Believe. <laughs> this person loves you more than you know. You just don't know, but they do, okay? Yeah, it's going to be some change ahead. It's going to be some sort of change, okay? Change. The change is coming because you let go. Okay, since you let go, you got this person's attention now. Lord, Lee, Lord, Lee. Your, your, your finances have increased. A lot of blessings has come your way since you walked away. Okay, but you also got to watch out for these haters, Virgo. Okay, like I said, a lot of people from your past is trying to come back, but nothing has changed. They're still not going to be able to take you. Okay, they can't take your swag. They can't take your positivity. They can't take your, your stride. They can't take nothing about you. Okay, they might mean well. All right, they might just be low vibrational. There's nothing you can do about that. It's nothing. The only one who can do something about that is them. Okay, and they are what they are. Okay, so you, you know. Just treat it with a long-handed spoon, especially if, you know, you feel like you're related to them or, you know, they was once your, your good friend back in elementary school, but you, you're an adult now. Things have changed. Y'all went in two different directions. Okay? You just have to treat it with a long-handed spoon because they can't take you. Yeah, it's the changes that they can't take. It's the changes in you that those haters can't take. Okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Many of you are that, are that divine feminine energy. Okay? That's a strong, powerful-ass energy. Okay? I, let me tell you, right on top of power. Right on top of power. Pay attention. Okay? Some of you are very strong. Very strong, divine, feminine energy. Especially my ladies. Okay? All right? The guys, too. All right? Some of you are dealing with a Leo here. Okay? Uh-huh. You might be attracting some sort of Leo. This person could be financially gifted. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They miss you. Whoever this person is that you're connected to, whoever whoever made you click on this read, this person is definitely missing you. Oh, my God. Somebody's in their feels over you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you might have caught them by surprise or something like that with this. Yeah, it's just you're too different. You're too different. Lordly, lordly. You something they ain't never deal with before. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. We also got divination, okay? Yeah, you guys love the tarot. Tarot loves you too, okay? Some of you are tarot readers yourself, okay? You might even know that this person was coming. You might have sensed this person is, you know, heart aching over you, you know, love sick over you. 
crying over you, missing you, wanting to know what happened. They miss making love to you, that's for sure. This person misses your touch. They need you. They want you back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some of you can feel it. Some of you already know it, too. Some of you saying good. Lordly. <laughs> you know you can't say good. <laughs> you know you can't say good. That's not fair. <laughs> Uh -uh. We got devastated, heartbroken, can't stop crying. This is the energy you got this person in, okay? This person had you in it. It looks like the tables have turned. Now they're in it, okay? You're saying good. Some of you are really saying good. It's, it, that's not good energy to be in, but yeah, you're still saying it. Yeah, they regret it, honey. They are regretting whatever they did to you, whatever they said to you, whatever fuck shit they put you through. They eating that shit now, okay? Yeah, okay? You don't have to do nothing. You don't have to say nothing. You don't have to do nothing. Karma got everybody's address. Just keep being the high vibrational energy that you are. Remember I told you guys, some of you are walking karma. When somebody come against you, when somebody do something against you, they get it with the quickness, okay? They try to backbite you, talk shit about you, all kinds of hell in their life start happening. Okay, some of you don't have to do nothing. You're already walking karma. Okay, I want you, I want us, Lord, this person that lost it, honey. When you was trying to be with this person, mm -hmm, they might have gave you their ass to kiss, okay? They might have act like they was too good for you or something like that, or you wasn't good enough for them. They might have tried to make you, you know, chase them or something like that, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got this person stressed now, all right? This person had you stressed, now they're stressed. All right, yep. Some of you are dealing with a cancer. This cancer might be very emotional over you. Okay, mm hmm. Mm hmm. Some of you are dealing with Sagittarius. Okay, mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, you might feel that this person is a liar, Sagittarius or the cancer. Okay, you might not trust their energy or something like that. Mm hmm. I miss you. They do miss you. You don't believe it, though. You think they're lying to you, but they're not. Okay, can I call you? I miss your voice. When I say they miss you, Miss you, miss you, miss you. Somebody is really missing the shit out of you, okay? <laughs> you are missed, honey. <laughs> Your absence has been felt, okay? Your absence has been felt. Somebody hasn't seen you. Somebody hasn't talked to you. They miss you, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, it's over. I want out of this relationship. I'm not happy, okay? They might be in another relationship with somebody else, okay? All right. You could have told this person that. You could have told them that you weren't happy. You're not getting enough time. This person just keeps procrastinating, bullshitting around. They playing with your emotions. Mm -hmm. Or this person is in a relationship that they're not happy in and they want out. They might be coming to tell you that too. Okay. That they in a situation they don't want to be in. Some of you are definitely dealing with a Libra. So that with the Justice card, you're definitely dealing with a Libra. Mm -hmm. Some of you are. Okay. We also have candle work. Okay, somebody's burning some candles. Okay, possibly to call you back or to stay in love with you or to keep you in love with them. Okay, uh huh. Or you're burning candles to bring this person to you. One of you, one of somebody's burning candles, you or your person. Okay. Mm -hmm. What else do we have? Spirit come through. What time is it? Mm, not bad. Come through, spirit. Whatever messages do you have, Spirit, come through. I guess I can use some of those big cards. They just hurt my hand. They're so damn big. I don't know why they make them so big. They're pretty, but they're too big. Mm -hmm. Settling. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Some of you feel like, ain't no way in hell you're settling. Mm-hmm. If you don't get what you want, you say it's not for you. If you not if you don't get if you have a checklist and if that's not checking off that list you say this is not for me, you refuse to settle. Okay, somebody may expect you to settle or want you to settle, but you're not settling. If it's not what you want, you're not settling. This person could have had you in a third party situation. You're certainly not settling for that because you don't have to. You can get your own. You don't have to share a man. You don't have to share a woman. Fuck that. Who wants to do that? Uh uh, they they get the person next week and you get this person this week. No, who wants to live like that? Uh uh, yeah, I might as well have a threesome if you're gonna share somebody. Good lord, 
Mm-mm, anybody going through that? You might be dealing with somebody that's not awakened, very unawakened energy, okay? It looks like they're trying to, though. It looks like they're trying to come to grips here with this. Okay, this person could have been very immature at first, didn't know what the hell was hitting them. Okay, very childish. Mm -hmm. We got material world, okay? They might like the material things in life, okay? They might be money hungry, mm -hmm. chasing that mighty dollar, okay? You got this person stressed. This person can't sleep at night worrying, worrying about you. Okay. Yeah. They want union. Union is definitely going to come in for you guys. Uh-huh. You know, this person is definitely doing some shadow work. They're working on some things about themselves. They're trying to better themselves. Actually, this person is trying to grow up. They're trying to mature out. Okay. Mm-hmm. They're trying to become what, you, what you're looking for, what you want, okay? You might have cussed this person out more times than you care to admit. They're starting to get it now, okay? Yeah, this person wants to compromise with you, okay? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you think this person don't hear you, but they hear you. They hear everything that you say, and they hear what you don't say. we got balance in the scales. There you go. This is the energy they want to come in. They want to fix things with you. Okay, this could have been very one-sided at one time. Limerous energy. You felt that you were the only one in love. You felt you were the only one in this relationship with this person. Uh-huh. This person lied and kept you waiting, kept you waiting. Some of you are in separation right now from this person, but this person can't, they can't take it. This separation is burning them. This person is missing the shit out of you. This separation is killing them. Okay. Yeah, you're killing them softly with this, separ with this separation. They really are being affected by this. They got a lot of pride and ego, okay? They're really being affected by this, okay? You guys could be mirroring each other, too. We got the mirroring card. Okay, you might be feeling the same goddamn thing they're feeling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you had a crossroad. Confusion. You both are. Mm-hmm. You guys are at a crossroad. You're like, what do you want from me? How am I supposed to fix this? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're at a crossroad. You don't know what they want. You're trying to figure it out, too. Okay? You don't know what to tell them. You're like, look, I don't know what to say. Spirit, come through. Can I have some more messages, please, for Virgo? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got boss daddy, stable, rich business owner, CEO, big dick energy. This person is the boss. This person does very well for themselves, too. Maybe this is why this person is so cocky, so arrogant. Okay, they might got a lot of pursuiters. They could have anybody that they want. Okay, mm-hmm. Yeah, but it's something about your energy, okay? You didn't settle. You didn't take the fuck shit that this person was trying to make you take or something like that. This person could also have a bad reputation, Okay. This person could be a heartbreaker. Very manipulating energy. Okay. Love you for the weekend. Love you for the day. Love you for the moment. And then off. Off to the next. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Somebody caught a case. Sexual infection. Sexual disease. Okay. Somebody sleeps around. Okay. Some sort of rash. All right. Mm. Okay, yeah, we got played out. You just might be fed up with this. This might be played out fucking energy. You might be like, uh-uh, I'm done. This is old. This is corny. I don't want no part of this no more, okay? And this person is coming back with with uh, one thing on their mind. You might have them blocked. They got one thing on their mind, and that's to reconcile with you. Mm -hmm. This person wants to be back into your energy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, we got waiting, waiting, waiting. Okay, this person made you wait. Now you're making them wait. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Spirit come through. Yeah, you might be getting a little tired, a little fed up with this energy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uninterested. Nope, you don't want to hear it anymore. You said, uh, blah, 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 blah. Honey, baby, you killed them softly, honey. You're killing them softly, okay? Some of you feel that you can't be nice to this person. You feel like when I'm nice to this person, this person walks all over me. I give them my ass a kiss, then they love me. Ay, my, ay, 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 ay. That could be the, that could be very, that very well could be the case. Because some people, they just don't, we got broke ass, somebody's losing money here, okay? We also got rejected, okay? You might feel rejected by this person, but they're definitely all in their head over you. Look at this person. This person is steady thinking about you. They miss you a great deal. Okay? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This person might be losing money. Some sort of karma is hitting this person. Might have lost a lot of money. I don't care if they're making money. I don't care if they got money. Any kind of money loss is recognized. Any kind of money loss matters. I don't care how much money you got. Okay? 
All right, we got Queen Rising. Okay, stepping into your power. Okay. Mm -hmm. Priest, priest coming up in the spotlight. You're getting a lot of attention, Virgo. You're that Queen Rising. Okay. Yeah, you're stepping up. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Spirit come back. Ooh, we got incarcerated. Some of, some of you dealing with somebody that's locked up or always in, locked up in and out of jail or something like that. Somebody could work for the prison. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's pull some more. What time is it? Huh? Not too bad. Let's see what else we got. You got this person's attention now, my love. Mm. Somebody is in their fields now. Spirit, can I close this out, please, with some more messages? I want to close it out. Anything else you want to say? Who's this person locked up? Who's locked up? Who's going to jail? Mm. Discovery. Something's going to be discovered here. Realization, insight, enlightenment, detection exposure something is about to be exposed okay whatever is about to be exposed this person could have to go to jail for okay mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. we got ancestral protection all right, we got ancestral blessings, ancestral spirit. You're very protected, Virgo. Your ancestors don't play about you, okay? You got some very powerful ancestors, and I don't care what people say. Oh, I don't believe in ancestors. Ancestors don't exist. When you die, you die. Mm. Some people are just so... Oh, they just irk me. I just, get, I just don't talk. Just don't talk. I just don't listen to it. Listen to me when I tell you, your ancestors protect the crap out of you, okay? You are only here because they exist. They got your back, okay? They watch over you. They guide you. Those little whispers that you hear, okay, that you think is your thoughts, and those are your ancestors guiding you, okay? Yep, some of you are definitely healers. I just called you guys healers earlier. Yes, you are. You guys are healers. Mm-hmm. This is why this person miss you so much. They miss that energy, that nurturing, healing energy. You're very intuitive. You got a healing touch. Uh-huh. Holistic energy, too. Some of you do energy work. Some of you actually heal people. Okay? Some of you work with crystals. Okay? You actually heal. Some of you give spiritual baths. Okay? Some of you do energy work. Okay? Shaman energy. You definitely do that healing. You mess with, You work with crystals. You you work with crystals and herbs. Okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Again. Oh, Lord, have mercy. I can't make this shit up. When I say y'all got a hater, it's always the haters. Okay? Okay. Listen here, Virgo. You might got somebody coming back from your past, okay? Could be fr old friends, relatives, you know, somebody you haven't talked to in a while. Their energy is not going to be any different, okay? The same reason why you cut them off before, you're going to discover it's the same reason why you got to cut them off again. Some people just can't be around your energy. You're too much, okay? They, I don't care how much they fake it and act like they can handle it. They can't. And you can feel it in their energy and you can see it on their face. Leave them where they stand. You're just too much for them. Okay? You can't apologize for who you are. This is a very mal malicious person. This person is bitter. This person holds a grudge. Got a lot of animosity towards you. Very spiteful. And they try to criticize everything that you, that you do. But they can't criticize shit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You guys are warrior of faith. Okay? You guys are warrior of faith. You know who you are. You know whose you are. You got healing prayers. Okay? You got blessings, integrity, victory, spiritual gifts. Okay? You know who you are. You can't be attacked. Okay? They can't try to pinpoint and criticize nothing on you. Okay? You don't work by yourself. All right? Mm-hmm. Shadow work. They need to do their shadow work, okay? You might have told them that. They might resent you for it when you do try to give them good advice or when you do try to tell them something good. Okay, so don't tell them shit. Keep it to them. Keep it to yourselves. You're very creative, too. There might be another thing that bothers them, okay? You're, you, you can come up with ideas that they be wondering, how? How do you do it? How did you think of that? You know, you're just very creative energy, okay? 
just the way you present yourself, just just the way you live, the way you decorate your home, everything you come up with. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you're very strong, okay? If it, if it will get out of my bracelet, I can show you. Okay? And you're very strong. You got the strength card here, okay? Lordly, lordly. It wasn't one, it wanted to stick to me. <laughs> It was caught on to my bracelet. It wanted to stick to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. But you, some of you get bored being in solitude a lot. So you want to hang out with somebody. You want to, you know, bust it up with somebody. But you got to be very careful who you bust it up with. Okay. And if you're going back to somebody that you used to know, you used to hang out, or sporadically you hang out with them, remember that energy. Okay. That hater energy is real. Okay. They don't look at they don't look at you with with um, loving. With a loving heart, okay? They don't speak to you with a kind heart, with a with good intentions in their heart, all right? It's, these people could be very envious of you, very jealous of you, okay? You will know, all right? You will definitely know. Mm -hmm. You're going to know. Spirit come through. Mm -hmm. Yeah, This is what they hate about you. Lordly, lordly. Did you see that? You guys are manifestors. You make it look easy. Some people have to struggle. Okay. But you have learned how to manifest. Some of you use different techniques to manifest. You might use the, the Sri Yantra. You might use the 369. You may use the bay leaves. You may use the cloves. You may use the cinnamon. You guys know how to manifest. You pull in what you want. No matter what it is. House. Car. Wife, husband, baby, a job, money, whatever it is that you want. You're very good at pulling it in. You can attract it. Really good at it, okay? Yeah, you master manifestors is what you guys are. Okay, be very mindful of that when you feel like, you know, you're by yourself. You got nobody to hang out with. You got nobody to talk to. Sometimes that's the best energy to stay in. Hang out with yourself. Roll by yourself. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this read. I certainly enjoyed bringing it to you. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Talk to you soon. Ashe.